Okay, so right here, I decide to uh, cut this maple clump. Yeah, you know, decide let that one kind of get out of the way. Can't really grab it very well. Um, you will just play with it for a minute, and there we go. So we're on to that one. We're done. And uh, now I got the other two stems that are on that stump and uh, I'm kind of approaching it the wrong way but it's kind of got a little bit of lean to it so I come into it hot do not grab it very good at all and here we have a dangler so now that I have it in the worst possible spot on this machine and uh, I have nobody around so here we go adjust the camera up let you uh, let you get a good visual here, and we're gonna start playing. Let's see, maybe if I lift it. Now let me back up. Okay, a little farther. Let's see. Now I have 50 foot behind me of the top of this tree. You would think. It, uh, it would be able to have enough weight to touch the ground and I should be able to drive out from underneath this thing. That's not the case today. So, we're just going to keep, yeah, just turn a little bit, drive forward again. Okay, wiggle, wiggle, a little, let's angle it down, it may come off there, but boy, that, the top of the head sticks up quite a little ways past where them cylinders are at. Okay, well, after numerous failed attempts of just, you know, raising and lowering um, and backing up going forward, seeing that it's not really helping. Um, okay, there we go. We've moved a little bit. Uh, let me think here. Okay, okay, all right, all right. Nope, nope. Uh, maybe if I turn. I turn, okay. All right, yep, there we go. That's a good resting spot right there against the cab. Okay, we're almost to the top of the head, and what I'm thinking here is if I get it to the top of the head, it should fall off, right? No, it, it falls back down into that horrible pocket that a tree should never be in. So I back up for quite a while. And uh, so usually I will put the butt end of that tree uh, against another tree and continue to drive into it and it will take that off there. But this time I wanted to try a little bit something different. You never know if you're going to be in a spot and you don't have any other trees. So here we go. I got it up, got it up as high as I can, and I'm just about to get in a good spot here. I'm setting myself up. I have now turned about 190 degrees from where I first started cutting that tree. Alright, I'm in a good spot, but now I ran out of room going forward. So, I'm going to start wiggling a little bit here. Just bang it off the cab real quick. One more time. There we go. Look at it. And that's all there is to it. And uh, then slowly you should be able to back it off that tire. There it is. Look at that. So, uh, yeah, that was that was about it. Nailed it.